Hello, I'm Toro, and um, today I have a little Target haul, a little diecast haul. These are from Target. We got two Majorettes. This Porsche is really cool. And uh, this is uh, actually a, a Nissan. And I also got a nine pack that was on clearance. I found it on a clearance section. And I got really excited about it because uh, you know, I got it for like $4.98, I think. Actually, yeah, let me pause and show that, show that picture. And I was so excited about this night pack until I kind of realized that, uh, like, I felt like something was wrong with this night pack, you know? Like, like what, like, what's up with this? I mean, I, it was pretty cheap for like four or something, say five bucks. It's a really cool little night pack. I mean, it's pretty cheap. But, um, but, um, the exclusive car, like, there's just something weird about it. And I mean, I thought, like, oh, you know, it looks pretty cool. BF Goodrich little truck. And then I started seeing, like, the picture over here. This is a Ford, I guess, like a Raptor. And this one is a Silverado. And then I saw the sign right there that said Hot Wheels. So I guess somebody took out the exclusive. I'm thinking maybe like the Target people, since they were gonna put it on clearance anyways, they they just filled that little spot with the, the Hot Wheels, or maybe or maybe somebody else just kind of switched the cars, but it was sealed, so I guess they must have glued it. So yeah, this is a this is a Hot Wheels car in a Matchbox box. So I was kind of like, oh man, that sucks, but um. The other cars are really nice. And it's nine cars for five bucks, so can't complain. But I also got these two majorettes. This is a Veylon. I'm not sure if you say that right. Little Porsche 934. This one's really cool. And actually, I opened these up so I can put them in these boxes anyway. So. This one has a metal body, rubber tires. It's a licensed vehicle. It's got opening parts and suspension. So it's pretty cool. Every time I find these major, it's like, I'm just opening it. Yeah, look at that, that's pretty cool. I like the color and everything on this one. cars are really sick oh, I must have had some paint rubbing right there so hopefully it's not too messed up no nah, it looks good check that out I like the wheels on this car look nice rubber tires gonna fix it up a little bit right there looks good yeah, these are rubber tires. Check out the details on this. <clears throat> this is number nine, Valent Kremer. Sick little Porsche. The colors are really cool though. Old school Porsche with the, uh, what do you call this? Uh, the wing, uh, it's a, uh, I forgot. I always forget when I need to remember. It says Porsche on the back. Get my magnifying glass. On. Porsche. Yeah, it looks really nice. What else with that company? Valant, I think it says. It's all black interior. It's got suspension, rubber tires. And these cars are like around three dollars, so like three something. Put it in the little boxer here. Porsche 934. It's a 157 scale, so pretty cool little box too. Put that in there.
And I also got another majorette. This is the it's a drift car. So this girl here is a drifter. Oh look at that. Big trophy she has. That's pretty cool. It's a pretty cool little car. And this one is um well, I guess it's maybe her name. Drifter Christy Lewis. It's got a little her little autograph right there. This is a pretty cool. It's got an opening hood. doors they are now they don't open the wheels look pretty nice though white wheels and this whole like wrap looks really cool looks really like drifting drift racing major it that's pretty cool it's like pattern looks really cool it's got the opening hood it's all metal body Plastic base, rubber wheels, rubber tires. It's got white wheels. It's number 70. And uh, this car looks actually pretty like different. Like, it's a, uh, what is this? Uh, a Nissan Sephiro 831. Never heard of that brand before. Never heard of that Nissan before, but um, must be exclusive to Japan and like Europe, maybe. I can't. But um, yeah, it's a pretty cool little car. It's a four door too. Drift car. It's got the little box with the the girl. Right That's a really pretty girl. And I'm gonna open up. The nine pack because I did get I did get um I don't say like scammed I mean it was on clearance it was five bucks but yeah they did switch out the exclusive car I guess that's what people were looking for should have been this um Ford Raptor so let me just open it up anyways I want to keep it like it's a nine pack and it's totally something else. But um you know see people actually do look for those exclusive cars, so I don't usually buy nine packs. And it's like ten dollars. Like over ten dollars. And um you know I kinda just stick to the basics or or the Hot Wheels Premiums. Check it out. That's the Silverado. Yeah, it's a Chevy Silverado. I switched it up. Yeah, I like the the package. Look, kind of like kind of a. Um, I don't know. It just seemed weird. Like it was kind of sticking out too much. Everything else is, is correct though. I did check this night pack and yeah, it was just the exclusive. That was bad. Got a little quad. I don't really collect motorcycles. It's pretty, it's pretty big. Huh? It's pretty cool, but it's pretty big. This one I did like though. The little rabbit. I got this one in a five pack, the off-road rally one. Rumping Racing Team. Golf number seven. It's got the little rabbits right there. Country, Volkswagen. Yeah, this one's really cool. And I got a couple Mustangs. It's like the newer Mustang. Mustang GT. This one looks pretty nice. I'll add this one to my Mustang collection, and then there's a classic Mustang. 
Some more 60s Mustang. This one's really cool. I like the color too. Green with the little white stripe. It's kind of like that um, that Mustang from Bullet or something. Uh, this one is just like a Fiat. Or country car. It's pretty cool. I think I had got this one in a five pack too. This one's the one that seemed really cool. Fire rescue. It's a van with like a little bit of well it's a more of an off-road van. It's all right on the top. Red glass. It's pretty cool. This one I really like. I really did like cargo car careers for all your moving needs, cross country transportation. Unit number fifty eight. I wonder if this opens back here. I don't know. Yeah, this one looks pretty cool. Look like a little UPS truck. And this is the one that I really like too. The Matchbox TV, channel 58. It says breaking news. News on the go. That's pretty cool. Yeah, this I really like this van. I really like this van. Uh, this. I don't, I don't really collect those but I really did like this van the colors the off-road van the new Mustang the classic Mustang and this one cargo couriers and the red oh and the silver is pretty cool too it's just that it's all wheels it's all good though five bucks for the for nine cars, so it's not bad. That's pretty much all I got. Got the two major heads and the nine pack. Each major head's like around three something. Oh, this is a Fiat. That's pretty cool. It's got some pretty cool wheels to it. It's just like a regular car though. And that's pretty much it. Little target haul. I put those in the little boxes. And I got some more of these little boxes too for the ones that fit. I don't think these are gonna fit though. No. It's way too big. But yeah, that's um, pretty much it. Thanks for watching and I'll see you guys later.